To understand the effect of fouling, let's refer back to the previous example of a backward leaning impeller. Here, the impeller is clean. Shown on screen, the gas velocity relative to the blade, as well as the blade tip speed, in clean conditions. The gas exit velocity is the sum of these two vectors, as depicted here. This gas exit velocity has the following flow angle. We'll call it alpha C. The letter C refers to the clean conditions. When the impeller becomes fouled, the area of the flow passage is reduced. Since the gas flow is equal to the product of the area and the gas velocity, then a decreasing area will result in an increasing velocity for a given flow. This is illustrated in red with the vector V relative fouled. In this case, the gas exit velocity will be as follows. This gas exit velocity has the following flow angle. We'll call it alpha F. The letter F refers to the fouled conditions. Now, let's get rid of the vectors U, V relative clean, and V relative fouled, as we don't need them anymore for the discussion that follows, and leave only R clean and R fouled. Next, let's plot on the graph the X component or tangential velocity for these two vectors. As seen here, the increase in the flow angle and the gas exit velocity due to fouling has reduced the tangential velocity of the gas. The tangential velocity of the gas in fouled conditions is lower than that in clean conditions. Now, since the head produced by the impeller is the product of the impeller tip speed, which does not change in fouled conditions, and the tangential velocity, which is reduced, then the head produced will be reduced in fouled conditions. In addition, the non-uniform distribution of the fouling will reduce the efficiency of the impeller stage. Let's have a closer look. Shown now on screen, the side view of a clean impeller with its corresponding performance curve, namely the head capacity curve, and the efficiency curve, as well as the impeller design point, and low flow limit or surge limit. Impeller fouling is the accumulation of material in the impeller passages, as depicted here. This will reduce flow area and roughen surface finish. It will also reduce impeller head capacity and efficiency, as depicted in this graph. Note here that the surge margin increases slightly in fouled conditions. This is because the cause of surge is low gas velocity. In this example, since the area of the flow passage is reduced, then the gas velocity increases, thus increasing the surge margin. The surge margin is defined as the flow at surge divided by the impeller design flow. However, the stage head produced by the impeller at any flow rate is reduced. Therefore, for the same process system head requirement, as depicted in this example, the impeller flow rate will be reduced from the design point to the fouled flow, thus forcing the operating point closer and closer to the surge line. 